Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Dark Cloud. In the last part, <coughs> we were left in the middle of the gallery of time, and in this part, let's go ahead and break a Dran's feather. Why not? <laughs> uh, I hope I have enough supplies to make it through this, at least in one fell swoop. Maybe not. It's pro it probably would be a good idea to go out and see if there are any items. Now is a good time to get Ruby out. Switch your weapon to Wind Element. Take aim. Fire. Okay, back to Goro. Now, Ruby to weaken them. Uh, okay. Ow. Well, that's a fine how you do. No, want nothing to do. You are pretty good at tracking your enemies. Come here. Okay. What's going on here? I was expecting him to attack, that's why I went ahead and did it, but let his guard down, which is all the same for me. Okay, this should be, yeah. Do I have that key? I think we picked it up. No, really? Okay. Ah, uh, the chest should be over here. Yeah, that's a mimic. I still hate these things with a passion. I don't care how many times I've seen them. And there we go. Oh man, 58. Uh, this is gonna be bad. No, no, that's not so bad. What we, what we really care about is the fact that it keeps, yeah, it keeps big bucks so we can cancel out the poor on Satan's axe. Although that makes sense, the axe should be cursed by all right. Uh. That's a weird sound for the mimic to make. I've never heard that before. So that's a good sum of money right there. I guess this would be a good place to grind up cash if you need it. Let's keep going. Sorry about that. Oh, oh okay. That's what I was talking about. Those invincibility frames right there. I was going to be hit by, like... Attack. So I instead dodged it. Okay, no. okay, that is getting really annoying now. Hmm, nice, two for one deal. And I got a new drawn's feather, which is all the better. Fire gem. Oops. This is a. There it is, the pitch dark key. Whoa! I'm just. Stop throwing mimics at me, game. Okay, let's go heal. Stop making that weird sound. Whoa! Alright, that's a bit more excitement than I'm used to in this game. Considering I've been doing nothing but grinding off kind of low-level enemies. I mean, still give good abs, especially from the back floor, but still. It's kind of... Kind of funky. Hang on. I'm not using my headset. I have to revert back to this old mic because my headset's been... Let's just say one of the wires got pulled so it doesn't exactly work the way it's supposed to. Let's go ahead and put the pitch dark key in here. Be on our merry way. Billy. Ooh. Uh, are you gonna stop blocking? Ah, no, he killed himself, which I don't think gives me the abs. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Let's not make Big Boy here touch the Atla. I don't, I don't know what happens if you touch an Atla without the Atla Milia. Horse Rider? I don't think we got the next memory, did we? At least not yet. Uh, first campaign. That sounds like a memory. Indeed it is. We need a horse rider. We need a sword. We need a wizard. We need the father for some reason, except he's dead. We also need another crown. 
But we're done with this floor, so let's go ahead and move on. Which is just right here, so slap that hands on the face. You know the drill by now. And go on. Go back even further in time. I think we'll hit uh, 79, maybe, maybe 80 years back into the past. We'll see. Hmm. Oh, 102 years ago. Things look a little brighter, don't you think? And the carpet isn't as crappy looking, but the place still looks like utter junk. Doesn't look like it's in much disrepair, though. That's a decent thing. Oh, why do I need a petite fish at this point in the game? Oh, don't tell me this is a mimic floor. Please don't tell me that. Six. In fact, what am I doing? We should be grinding up Goro's hammer. That's another good instance of that little invincibility frame there. He would have clearly been hit had I not have done that. And... Ooh, okay. What is that? Oh. That's a heart soldier. Which is clearly a mage. Stop that. Stop that. Nope. You're not allowed to attack. I don't know what you do, but... I'll just keep whacking it. Ow. Okay, Goro, what's wrong with your hammer? Er, no. Oh, it got slowed down, didn't it? Great. Ah, dandy. Well, can't be helped, I guess. Air powder, which is always nice for a dungeon to give you. Another mimic, another mimic. Honestly, I just took a guess out there, so... There isn't any... Ooh. <laughs> nice stop there. I hate to waste a uh, auto repair powder for that. Yeah, it's been a while. Let's go ahead and see Zhao's animation. And no Zhao. There you go. Still, I don't know. That looks like anybody could jump it. I mean, it'd be a little precarious, but... Yeah. I'm just saying, it's it's entirely possible to jump that. Okay, so we open this. And we got the wizard. Ooh, who's the wizard? What kind of fragment of set of memory. I not tell you, but he, he looks a little dark. I don't like that. Okay, get Gore out again. And... Go ahead and get this thing out of the way. Not this entirely. Get hit again. So, where is it? There's some revival powder. We got another one from the dungeon, so that's awfully nice of it. We could use cream chicken. Got plenty of that. This thing clearly isn't going to be easy to kill, is it? You're just going to sit there? Hello? <laughs> sometimes, sometimes glitches can be funny. Especially when an enemy doesn't do anything. I don't know if that was an animation error or if that was just an error in general. Uh, another heart, which I'm not too terribly fond of. Hey now, why don't you do that glitch like your friend did? Or, you know, stop trying to back up like that. Okay, walk into me, why don't you? Ah, uh, that's kind of lame. But, well, it's programmed into the game. I hate to take advantage of it. Oh yeah, the staircase is almost over there is perfectly fixed. Oh, thank you, that's nice of you. You know what? There you go. That's more like it. I don't know. I just hate enemies that constantly dodge you all the time. They're just too terribly annoying. What we got here? 
we have the father again. So we can go ahead and slap him right there. Oh, Mimic. Uh, Goro, you're up. And do a number on you. Ooh, whoa, 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 again. I know we don't need it, but I'd rather not waste the auto repair powder. Especially on a weapon that we're going to break down anyway. Come here. Stop being a pansy and running away from me. I really don't care if you're going to die from this. All that matters is I can take you down. Now we have a crown. Lots more. Let's go ahead and put that on the memory. Now we just need a sword. Now where are we? Oh, I got one right here. Nah, that'd be a waste. King Mimic, maybe? Nope. It's actually a chest. Force it open. Curse. And we have... What is that thing? That looks about as bad as the Baron Garion. It's timid, sort of like a lamb. Appears to be weak, but... But what? I, I don't know. It probably evolved into something decent. But by the looks of it, it's not decent enough statistics. And then I wouldn't use it at this point. I have the Chronicle Sword, for crying out loud. I thought that was a door. Yeah, there's a rash dasher there. Try saying that five times fast. Whoa! Just swing it out of open air there, buddy. Once again... One more level and we can break this down and put it on the axe, and then we can go ahead and... This is... No. But we can go ahead and use it. Because if this is the only slot open, and there's a reason for that, it's for the big bucks hammer. Okay. Kind of catches me off guard when I'm expecting treasure, but that's about it. Gee, starting to run low on that powder. I mean, we could probably steal some from them. Ow! From the mimics. But right now... Well, does it look like this thing has bandit? Steel? I mean... Open this up. And we have... <clears throat> Magical crystal. Which tells us that there's one more atla on the floor. I'm not gonna deal with you with Goro. You're, you move too much. There we go. Okay. Once more. You lying jerk. Well, what else can you expect from a mimic? No. Oh. Hold still. Hold still. There we go. Take a quick right breather right there. Go northbound. Right, and another weapon chest. Is this poison? And it is just another one of these. Well, clearly I'm not going to use Mgago, so that is completely useless. Map. Whoa! You really had me there, big. Nope. Oh, now you got me. Stop it. And wait an hour for him to fall down. I, I still find that glitch humorous. It just kind of sits there. and I don't know. Most glitches I think are funny. And, yeah, oftentimes it's kind of amusing to make them happen. But in this situation, that's more or less a time waster. Because you won't get the abs until it hits the ground and disappears. Which I think is a weird flag for to, to give out the abs. I think as soon as an enemy hits zero HP, it should give out the abs rather than wait until the enemy disappears. I don't know. I'm not too big into coding, especially games. But, I don't know. I, I think it'd be easier to checkmark it to flag when an enemy HP hits zero. But then I suppose 
if you could play it outright, you could get um, infinite abs that way. Hmm. Never really thought about that one. So maybe they were on the right when they went ahead and get, put the flag on when it disappears. Okay, there's our sword. No, it's not a weapon. It's not an item either. There we go. And let's go ahead and check out this, the first campaign. They lie in wait for us, veiled by the morning mist. I give my troops the signal. The cavalry slices through this ferocity before me. Is this war? I thought I heard my father's voice. Do not fear. Your task is to protect this country. Well, where's the bloody wizard? We didn't see any bloody wizard, now did we? Bah. We got chipped. This here and open. Whoa! God dang it! There are too many mimics here. No, nope. that's right. You stay right there. I'm going to repair this real quick. And come here. what can I say about enemies that back up like that? Stupidly annoying. Clock hands. Of course, it's on the last enemy I kill. But I think, now that we're at the 100 year mark, we're gonna start making bigger time interval skips. Like, from 66 to 102 like that did, now I think we're gonna go from like 102 to like 150, maybe. Oh, I, I, need, to, I need to show this real quick. There is no doubt, Goro can't jump this distance. I don't know, I was just playing about, and I did this for a big gap. Like, you know, something that only Osmond could fly over, and it said that, I, have, I don't know. I find that kind of humor. Yes, that's true. But I also just find it hilarious. So I was kind of sitting there laughing for a little bit. But at any rate, we might as well get out of here before before we let that little joke dwindle or last, I suppose, for too long. So slap the hands on the clock and touch the clock face. And we are out of here. Well, out of the floor. We're not out of the dungeon. <laughs> not by a long shot. I think we go, like, all the way back 400 years. So to the next floor. 109 years. Oh, no. That was a very small interval. Diamond. So thanks, because I don't want to deal with you. Let's switch to Goro again, because he's the one with the big hammer. Oh, for... You can stop blocking this instant. And you can... Okay, you know what? Ruby, get out here. I ain't dealing with you with Goro anymore. I don't know. Will a diamond stick around long enough for Goro to smack it in the face? By the looks of it, because it takes a spear and it kind of needs to be close for that one. Come on. Or whatever you're doing, cowering in fear. Ah, there are the clock hands. Open this. Can you mimic? No, wrong side. No, no, you again. Hey, what's up? Everybody happy? Blah, blah, blah. Uh, I picked a big box the last time I saw this guy, so let's pick a small box. Thanks. Really appreciate it. Oh, I didn't get the chance to charge that up, so I could... And my, in my in invincibility. Thank you, tongue. And there we go. My invincibility wore off after being hit. Go ahead and take Tone out again. I know I named him Nathan, but I'll be going back and forth. And Menace of the West. I suppose that is indeed another memory, so we need the wizard again. A broken sword. What happened to your sword? We need a horse rider. We need a castle. And we need Sophia. Hmm. So we need all of those. Uh, Goro, you're out again. This thing is taking quite a long time to upgrade. Uh, repair it real quick. It's down to eight. And now we're only down to ten repair powders. We may need to make a quick pit stop out of this dungeon, but 
Whoa, okay. That's another thing I like about Goro. Sometimes he'll double hit, which is really nice when that happens. Well, like now, before I didn't even know he did that. But when he doubles... The, the thing about double hitting is that'll also double how much weapon HP he'll take away. So, there's a horse rider. And birds want something, I'm not entirely sure. There. <laughs> Just one-shot you. This. I think you have. Whoa, okay! Somebody doesn't like Goro today. Yeah, I think you have to be within a certain distance of the enemy. Else, if you try to do the double hit trick, it won't work. Alright, dead. Thankfully, there's a restoration point here. Huh, Alter fix a little bit. It still looks like, you know, you don't know what that is. It doesn't look too friendly, the way the colors are, anyway. But we can't quite say what that is, either. And I mean, don't get me started on the torches. Those are flat-out creepy in general. Okay, dealing as much damage as we can. Aw, oh, you cheeky jerk. Come here. And dead. Let's just keep going. Take it. Oh, we need a key. Did we pick up a key? I don't know, my memory fails me sometimes. Ah, well, other than this key. So we need to backtrack a little bit to find what we didn't see. Uh, well, there's the exit, so that's not what we didn't see. Uh, mimic? Nope. Warp. Ah, there's an atlas this way, so it's a good thing we're going back. Uh, another wind gem. Merchant fodder at this point. In which case, our merchant will be the fairy king. Dodge attack. Four times. Not quite sure what it wanted to do there, but that was peculiar. Okay, switch to Nathan. Grab the Atla. And now we have the wizard again. I wonder what's up with this guy. He's appeared more than once now, and I don't like it. He looks creepy. I suppose we'll find out, though. To the south. Go ahead and grab Goro. Okay. Somebody really doesn't like Goro today. Oh, thank you. Thank you for guarding. Boy, I, I don't know about enemies that guard. They're weird. Let's more dodge that thanks to the invincibility frames. Take this chump out using the ruby. Okay, antidote amulet, which personally I'm not going to use. Take out the living armor this way. I don't think Dora would do enough damage really. So no point in wasting the weapon HP. Yeah, that's right. I knew I saw something on the map. Go ahead and grab this. And we got a broken sword, which, uh, maybe we can use some repair powder on it. Well, no, it's in Atla, and it's a part of a memory. So two more, the castle and Sophia, which, um, doesn't look like there is that. I don't even think we need the pitch dark key for that last door, so I think we should ignore this last chest. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, get out of the way. Shield your friend there. In fact, I don't even think that's your friend. Take out the living armor. Oh. And now this thing is up there. Can I put anything on it? Yes, I put some gems, so let's upgrade this. It's now Athena's armor plus one. Uh, just checking. We still need Mimic and Rock Breaker, but we're good on metal. We need all the elements, we need attack and magic power. But as I've stated before, I'm not too concerned about that. I mean, this thing is god-awfully powerful. Whoa! Okay, buddy. Didn't know you wanted to die that soon, anyway. Alright, uh, let's ignore that chest, because there's nothing in that other room. So it'd just be faster to go back. 
Uh, I, I don't know there wasn't a hole on this floor, but if you may notice, the map is a really weird color. It actually makes it difficult to f see where holes are, so... It's not a big deal, because you can pretty much just instantly switch back and forth between two characters. So you don't need to get some prep work, so... Go back further in time! No worries, I don't think it's done much longer. Much is much longer. I think we only have about four memories left. 122 years ago. Check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. That was a little off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so let's keep going. Take this guy out. Which isn't too hard, but considering this weapon's slow, which is tedious. Another dark flower. This better not be like. Whoa! Crap! There we go. Oh, come on. I can only hit twice. Oh. I'm crying in the sink. I'm going to pick that up. And we're good to go. Now just take whatever's out of this, which is a carrot. Now there's a chest over here, which has a mind of healing. I don't know how often we'll be using those, but it's good nonetheless. Evil bat, go away, please. Well, no, I just want your abs. Whoa! Okay. Stop running around. Jeez, man. And dead. With a speed plus one drop. Not that that's very useful. Let's repair this real quick. Almost done with this big bucks hammer, which will probably be the last weapon in the game I ever decide to use. To, well, break it down. And... There we go. There are clock hands. And that is a really weird close-up. Ah, spade. Well, you know, he's got something like a spade. It's a sword, but... Hey, now! At the end of the day, I guess a hammer beats a sword, right? No? Okay. There we go. Another spade. I swear, these card soldiers are just bizarre. I mean, don't get me wrong, they look kind of cool, but... Why in this dungeon do these things show up? I think they'd make more sense on the moon. And dead. Let's go ahead. No. Wep, no. Well, we could do it from there, but I think this is faster. There we go. Let's down there. Oh, it's a fountain. Hey, look, it works. There's some water. Don't drink from it, which I find really odd. This spade which should be the last. Whoa! Oh, thanks, game, for being on my side on that one. I can't see what's going on. You out. And is that enough? Nope, not enough cabbage. Dodge that. Oh. Ah, crap. Well, thankfully that's nearby. Dodge that. Yes, we can hit, hit, and nearly. We're nearly there this memory out. And what we get is the castle. Alright, so Sophia must be on this floor somewhere. Now let's just go ahead and open that chest over here. Just begging to be open. Mimi, which I still don't have any use for. Oh, I don't plan on fishing. But you never know, I might have to. 
especially if I do that um, one thing. Which, oh, oh okay. You bit me. And now the big bucks hammer is at plus four. So, upgrade. And status break. I got the sense here. Customize. Since here is down here. Equip it. And dang it, there's one powerful act, ain't it? Well. Let's equip it. And I don't know why Goro is holding this axe, but hey, I guess he's a demon. I guess that's why nobody likes him. Maybe? No? Okay. Still though, it's 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 a decent weapon. No, that's pretty darn resilient at that. Sophia. Or no, the deal. Ooh, what's going on here? Yeah. We don't really need to be grinding anyone else up, so I think I can stick with Tom. Well, no, that's not true. We could... Nah, let's stick to Tom. Nathan. Oh, ow! Okay. Good thing I picked up some soap. Don't want to waste a mighty healing on that either, but... Soap would just be an inventory clutter. This up, and we have Sophia. There we go. We're not gonna use her on the deal if she's there. I doubt she is. Menace from the West, and no, she's not. So, Menace of the West. Allies fall. The West is a wizard with fearful magic. Now, that's where the wizard comes from. Are we losing? No, I will not retreat. I must hold here, or those devils will invade your castle. Or, don't you mean our? Anyway. So we got our next memory that we need to be fixing up. Uh, this dungeon pretty much just throws everything at you as you go, which is... Yeah, it's nice. Because, I mean, the last... How many dungeons? Five dungeons, I think? No. Well, yeah, five, because we got Zhao from the first, we got Goro from the second, Ruby from the third, and Gaga from the fourth, so on and so forth. Except there's like a little more. Got it, doing that. <laughs> well, I need to show off Goro's power with that axe, because I've shown pretty much everybody else except, God forbid, and Gaga. Let's go ahead and slap the hand. Oh, no, that's a key. I'm pretty sure it'd fit in there, but we might break it. And then where do we go? We stuck. So let's go even further back in time. And to the next floor. Oh damn, I just realized we were running pretty late on time, so. Okay, let's stop here. Stop the recording. But so guys. In the next part, we'll go ahead and get even further into the Gallery of Time, which, at this rate, we're 140 years in. The place still looks kind of crappy, but it's, it's getting there. It's looking better. So, I'll see you guys in the next part. Until then.